Well, I was able to get a college education, and I think it's very important. And I was just glad that I've been able to share a little bit to help others to get a college education. Well, I've always felt a closeness to the college because that brought me to Tennessee because I grew up in South Carolina. So I came to Tennessee and I was able to get a job here is why I stayed. And I, yes, I've had a very closeness because I feel like my life was greatly enriched by coming. Um, my name is Taylor Richardson and I am a senior here at Maribel College. I'm a biochem major with a business minor, which is something I just picked up this year. I've played football here at the school and I'm currently playing soccer. I'm also involved in a couple clubs um, like FCA and um, the American Chemical Society. And um, I play Frisbee too with the Frisbee intramural team from time to time. So I like to think I'm pretty involved on campus. I'd like to get into med school. I'm applying right now and finishing up my application. And so if all goes according to plan, I'll get accepted and then go to med school after this. I met Taylor after he had sent the first letter saying that he was had received the scholarship. There was something about Taylor's letter that just appealed to me and when I tried to get in touch with him, we did make contact and we just uh, have hit it off, I guess you can say. And he's a, a wonderful student and everything it's in, in you want in a student to have, he has those characteristics, I think. Well, we haven't been together as much as we would like to have, but he has a busy schedule, but the times we have been together, we've had several meals together, and uh, he's been over to the house, and uh, we just pick up like we left off yesterday and start talking again. <laughs> it's been that kind of a warm relationship. You know, like she said, it's just been a really, really warm welcome at the college overall, and then to meet Miss Jackson. The the lady who was giving me some money to go to this school was a really unique experience and and I feel bad for the other students who don't get to know their donors as well because I feel like that does add to the feeling um, of community of the campus and I also feel like it's kind of added some accountability to my studies because it's put a face with who's giving me this opportunity to go to school here and so you know I'm not only working hard in the classroom to better myself but also to make her donation worthwhile and I think that's kind of a unique thing that Maribel does in the meeting your donors, it kind of adds some accountability to your studies. But aside from that, um, I've just really enjoyed the relationship with her. I felt like um, her stories about the school are, are fascinating and uh, she has so much wisdom. Each time we talk, you know, she's got good advice to give and she's warm. I've invited friends over to her house as well and we just always have a great time. So it's just like another member of my family, really. I was going to say, I've told my children that Taylor, <laughs> if I could adopt her, would adopt another son. That he fits the bill. So it, it's been a wonderful relationship. And of course, the stories I tell are just the facts about the way things were in the olden days at Maribel College. <laughs> Quite a change from mm -hmm. current days. Well, I think for any school, money is always going to be an issue of some kind. And um, at Maryville, that's the case, definitely. And so I think through the Jackson Family Scholarship and other donors, that definitely makes it more possible for people like me who may not have been able to come to Maryville otherwise, come to Maryville and get such a good education here and experience the community that is just so nice and a great part of the college life that I don't think otherwise I wouldn't have been able to come here if it hadn't been for Ms. Jackson and her scholarship. Well, anyone that can afford it, I think they'll be blessed just knowing that they have helped some other students. And it's been, uh, I've enjoyed getting to know most of my st uh, ones that I've helped. But we've had a little closer relationship for some reason than uh, some of the others. And I think this is the first time that the scholarship has been given to one person for the four years, and I'm pleased mm -hmm. with that. I think once I get out and am able to, I think it's definitely a cause worth giving to to help people get a college education. You know, like Ms. Jackson said, that especially more and more these days is so important, 
And I think if we can give more people that opportunity, then, you know, the world will be better off. And I think there's some reward for us, too, as well. Your gift does matter. Your gift matters. <laughs>